first, to get to your personal degree works page, you should navigate to your MyBSU dashboard. Once there, click on the self-service banner. On the following page, select the student link. In the following menu, select DegreeWorks for students. This will take you to your DegreeWorks homepage. You should see a block with your student ID, your name, and your degree. Below that, in the same table, there is more information on your classification as a student. Below the first block, there are two tabs. We have selected the academic view to show our current progress in our selected degree. If you wanted to see what your progress level would be in a different major, select the tab label What If. From this page, you'll be able to change variables such as your degree, catalog year, program, major, minor, and concentration. Then by clicking the process What If option, DegreeWorks will generate a hypothetical course list and progress bar detailing the classes you need to complete to obtain that degree. Under the tab is a block that allows you to select what format you are viewing and see your degree progress and your credit requirements respectively. While these are visually helpful, it's important to check your program's requirements below to make sure you're on the right track. You will see a block with the name of your degree. This tells you how many credits you have, as well as how many credits are needed to complete your degree. The next block details the university core curriculum which are classes that all Ball State students are required to take, in addition to showing you which classes will satisfy that requirement. It shows categories for different required core classes as well as shows grades for completed classes. Notice how your transfer credits from IU and Ivy Tech satisfy their counterparts in Ball State's core curriculum. Any credits transferred to Ball State that meet a requirement will be signified by a green check mark. The following block is all about your major requirements. This table will often display specific messages regarding your major, as well as grades and course requirements. You can also see your major's GPA here in addition to the credits you've completed towards your major. At any point while on DegreeWorks, you can click on any course to see its description, prerequisites, and when it's offered. If you scroll down on the page, you'll see a block for general electives and a block for insufficient, which you will only see if you've withdrawn from a class. If you're looking for withdrawals from past courses, you'll find them under the insufficient tab. And that's DegreeWorks. Thanks, Charlie, for showing us around.